Hello and welcome. It's now Saturday 8 o'clock, which means it's time for only one thing. It's Quiz for NHS Family Special with Bobby Seagull. We are about to start. We're about to start round number two. So the, the Flittons are on, uh, are on um, three out of five. Come on, let's get you back in the game. Good start, but let's keep progressing. So geography. Geography. These are pictures. Pictures. I have a little sip of water. So I speak a lot, don't I? Ooh, I feel so much better than I did a few weeks ago. Ooh, okay, here we go. That was an aside to myself. It wasn't meant for you guys. Okay, question number one. Identify this African country by the flag. Identify this African country. Identify this African country. few t Twitter scores coming in. We got um, threes from the Clarks and the Max and a four from the Princeps. Well done. Okay, question number two. Identify this city. Identify this city. Identify this city. That is question number two. Question number three. What is the name of this bridge? What is the name of this bridge? What is the name of this bridge? That's question number three. Question number three. Okay, question number four. Identify this country by the outline. Hmm. Identify this country by the outline. Which country is that? Betsy Gant says that's her favorite bridge in the whole world. It's a pretty cool bridge, isn't it? It is a very cool bridge. So identify this country. Hmm. Okay, and then your final question, I will reverse them all back. The final one in this round is, identify this English cathedral. Identify this English cathedral. I have a, I have a friend who's an international friend called anne Catherine Sternberg, one of my best friends. She's taking part in the quiz and she laughed at the answer to question four because she knew it. So if you'd listened to her name, her name would have given a clue about the answer. That was question number four. So thank you, Anne, Kathleen, for joining in. Okay, so identify this English cathedral. Hmm. Have a guess. It's not East Ham. It's not East Ham. Martha from Doncaster's dad says uh, she thinks the quizzes are great. Thank you from Doncaster. Who's from Doncaster? We have um, Jeremy Clarkson. We have uh, Louis Tomlinson. Doncaster's a cool place, cool place. Okay, so I'm gonna reverse them back and we'll go through the answers. So number five is identify this English cathedral. Hmm. Question four was identify this country. Question three was what is the name of this bridge? Question two, Identify this city, that city, and number one is identify the African country. That means it's time for your 10 second dance, 10 second dance. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Time's up, time's up. How do we do in geography this week? Let's see, let's see. So, question number one was Ethiopia, Ethiopia. Question number one, Ethiopia. Question number two. So this building, uh, the construction started in 1914, but the designer, the architect, by the time he died in 1926, I think only a quarter of it was completed. But by 2010, only a half of the building had been done. Uh, and they expect by 2030, uh, it should be done. And this is, 
Gaudi Sagrada Familia in Barcelona. 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 So there we go. Barcelona. Oh my, oh my God. That's one of my favorite songs ever. You know the Freddie Mercury and um, was it uh, Montserrat Caballé, the singer? Barcelona. Yeah, so this is Barcelona. Okay. Oh God, that's going to be a sing-along one week. Uh, this one here. So this bridge was built in 1883 and it was initially called the New York and Brooklyn Bridge, but it's now the Brooklyn Bridge. And if you bought East River Bridge, that's fine as well, but it's the Brooklyn Bridge. There you go. That's question number three. Betsy Gantz says it's her favourite bridge. It is a cool bridge, isn't it? And then question number four. My friend anne Katrine Sternberg, one of my best friends, she just WhatsApp me from Germany saying, ha ha, because I bet you got that right, anne Katrine. Um, there you go. That's question number four. And the fifth one, bit of facts. So we actually looked at this in my class on the Great Five London because St Paul's Cathedral in London before... Before 1300, Fitzroy Wild was actually the tallest building in the world. Then this building here with the spire at 159.7 meters was the tallest building in the world for 240 years. For 249 years rather. And this is Russians like, apparently it's quite a popular visiting site for Russians. This is Salisbury Cathedral. There you go, Salisbury Cathedral. Let me know what your cumulative score is after two rounds. Let me know what your cumulative score is after two rounds. And I'll, I'll get your scores in. Get your, again, WhatsApp, Instagram, Twitter, Facebook, YouTube. Give me all your scores. Okay. So, um, so if you're enjoying the quiz, if we can enter the last round. Um, I'd love for you to share pictures on your social media. Again, uh, tag me on your Twitter app, you know, tag a picture of me in the quiz or on Instagram as a story, just so I can spread the word. Uh, so I'm gonna, my plan is to keep on going um, for as long as we can. Again, at some stage, I'll probably go back to work in terms of traveling around the UK, etc. Uh, but for now, uh, while I'm at home, I'll still run the quizzes for you guys. Okay. Well, thank you for joining. Um, so this is um, my just uh, giving quiz. Again, if you feel like you're enjoying any of my quizzes, feel free to go to justgiving.com forward slash quiz for NHS. Hello, Jessica Webb on Instagram. And um, if you're enjoying the quizzes, please do feel free to tag me on your stories uh, on Instagram at Bobby underscore Seagull or Twitter or Facebook, anywhere. And then, you know, the more of these, I'll give you loads of samba. Yeah, I like the samba. Okay, you see you all. Lots of love. Thank you so much. You uh, Bobby Seagull. Family friendly. Good night. So I'll see you soon.